I knew I wanted to be in carpentry my whole life. I wanted to learn how to live off the land. And I wanted to learn how to trap, but my father didn't know how to trap. So I had to find, find family members who knew how to live off the land. Now after leaving the reserve and doing all that for myself, I felt confident enough to further my education. I had my daughter and things were getting kind of hard with living and supporting her with the student allowance I was getting. So I decided to move back. And when you've been gone in the trade for two years and have been inactive, you lose your status or your level. I was working with uh, contractors in the community. We started off building the new store. Apprentices were assigned to work with the Red Seals that were hired by the company. Well, then they lay us off for work. Each time we have school, we'll have like a week or two weeks to prepare for the level that we're taking. They also give us the Red Seal test that from, from um, years back, you know, so they'll prepare us like that. So that's one of my dreams is to go back and open up my own business, that's for sure. Build traditional homes too. So that's why I'm becoming a carpenter, so I can do that. My whole life, everyone telling, telling me to do that, go to school and get education, come home and help the community. You know, I'm almost there right now, so it's gonna be reality soon.